Hi YouTube, Mac Pro 6.1 here. Great looking machine. I just love how it looks. I had an issue with this Mac though. I have uh, I had 64 gigs of RAM on it. This one's another one. I'm using the same one to record this video. So I had 64 gigs of RAM in it and uh, and a D300 uh, graphics card to graphics card. I upgraded the CPU to 2.7 uh, 12, uh, 12 core model. And I had an issue with it that it would shut, you know, it would restart without any uh, error messages, without any, uh, any, any reason, I would say. Uh, sometimes, you know, if I uh, open up OBS, you know, recording video it would just shut down. Sometimes if I uh, put a little stress on CPU, sometimes just out of the blue, you know, but I was just browsing internet and um, I could not figure out what's going on. I was blaming the GPU. Uh, at one point I was blaming CPU. Uh, I blamed the RAM too, but I ran a, I did run a, a RAM test and it came out fine. So uh, I ruled out RAM in the beginning. Uh, but um, what it turned out to be is actually the RAM. Uh, when I got another one and I switched the same, I put the same RAM in the, in the other one and it was exactly doing the same thing. So I just figured, you know, let me try to do, you know, to use different RAM. And uh, with 32 gigs of RAM from the other Mac Pro, it was working fine actually. So I uh, went on a mission to figure it out. Uh, so I, obviously it's a RAM issue. So I uh, went ahead and uh, figured out uh, which RAM module is giving me an issues. And this is the one and uh, I'm gonna check the microscope. Uh, I don't really see anything. I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, check it out with you. So you can see that there's no obvious reasons for it to fail basically. Everything looks pretty solid here. And I believe this is the original Apple RAM that Apple put in here from the beginning, according to this sticker, this is kind of looks like an Apple sticker. Phoenix memory. So this RAM stick failed for no reason. And it was causing me all kinds of issues. You know, it's been going on for like uh, all, uh, about like three weeks since the first day I got this Mac Pro. I said I got a second one after. But anyway, so uh, If you have this kind of issue when your Mac Pro is just uh, randomly restarting itself and it does not give you any errors in uh, uh, console. So I checked out the error log, you know, it doesn't give you uh, that, you know, it doesn't give you any messages, you know, when you, you know, when it restarts that the computer shut down unexpectedly or anything like that. No error messages in the console, not like nothing, like nothing ever happened, but it just constantly reboots itself. So if you have that issue, make sure to check the RAM because this RAM is, is like, it's cheap. You know, you can get uh, this 16 gigs uh, module on eBay for like nine bucks. I checked today, it's eight, $8.88. You know, the cheapest, uh, the cheapest uh, option there. So this nine bucks thing, you know, can ruin your uh, whole Mac, Mac Pro experience. So even if, even, even if uh, in system profiler in, uh, system information it shows that uh, that the RAM you know, it's okay next to it it doesn't it doesn't mean it's okay and as I said my RAM test it did not it did not pick, pick it up too so uh, but uh, gladly you know I came uh, uh, I ruled out this issue because it was just kind of driving me crazy you know at some point you know and uh, uh, otherwise you know it's a great Mac Pro you know it has lots of life left in it and uh, I really like its design. So once again, if you have that restarting issue, you know, don't blame anything else, blame the RAM first and check the RAM, change the RAM and see if it's gonna, uh, uh, if it's gonna perform differently. Thank you very much for watching guys. If you like my videos, please hit that thumbs up button. Appreciate that and have a lovely day.